Hello, Natasha. This will be some midterm video feedback for you, primarily on the, uh, the print ad. And we've got four weeks left. Uh, if you have any questions or if I can encourage you in any way, don't hesitate to reach out. My number is published in the announcements. So uh, what I've been telling everybody, and myself included, is I bid you strength from now uh, until the end of the term and beyond. Natasha, I like, I like the minimalism of this. Um, I like the quartering, or not quartering, but the, I guess, the division. Um, I like that it's asymmetrical, that you've used, you know, three rather than four. And I think your choices are appropriate. The color uh, also has been adjusted, I think, to match the corporate palette. These transitions maybe are a little, um, I don't know, could be a little smoother somehow. They look a little smudged, perhaps, but... <clears throat> Um, maybe you can change the transparency of them or the opacity. I like the idea, though, I like that they present themselves as a single composition. Um, and, you know, be careful about the edges. Magazines are trimmed. Uh, you would most certainly lose some of this. So be careful about bringing things so close to the edge. And I think contact information, take a look at professionally designed ads to see how much they can get away with or how little. Um, and follow suit. I think, you know, maybe the URL is necessary, phone number perhaps, address. Um, I don't know. It, it, it can be shortened or simplified maybe to a single line, perhaps with bullets or extra word space between each of the entries. Think about moving things around. Uh, you are going to probably want to have a slogan or a catchphrase of some kind. Um, if you do, though, you know, I hope you don't destroy the sort of the the clean simplicity of this. This is very attractive and without much text I think it conveys um, uh, peace, uh, relaxation, a tropical environment but one that isn't you know strictly uh, uh, strict. <laughs> okay I'm going to open it up in uh, Illustrator to see how your file is structured. Uh, Natasha this it looks like you're taking screenshots of your process that's good. You'll knit those into a um, uh, final reflection document and illustrate it if, if, if you want. It doesn't have to be about four or five pages and it will include screenshots not only of the process uh, on the print ad but also on the web banner. Um, here is your final. I'm going to open it in Illustrator. Now, uh, that, sorry, that's not yours. <laughs> uh, that's Donald Cartier's, also in this class. And let's see. Um, first off, I see that you have embedded images. So good on you, you know, uh, rather than link them. I didn't receive a bunch of error messages about missing images. And you've got everything on their own layer. I can turn them on or off at will. So uh, transparency. Um, you know, perhaps, 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 perhaps you can vary the transparency of this if you haven't done it already. Um, opacity. And that might give you a little smoother transitions, but maybe not. No, it's not. Let's see, maybe not so much. Yeah, I don't know. You did a better job. Um, I would avoid certainly avoid using outlines. I don't. I, some of these boxes seem to have um, borders on them. All right, I'll leave it here, um, Natasha. But you know, you have a great collection of items to work with, and I look forward to seeing how you refine them. Keep it. Keep it airy. <laughs>